Hi Sagittarius, it's Power and Light Tarot coming at you with the reading. Sagittarius, this is what are their true intentions and love. And these are general, so they may or may not resonate. And also Sagittarius, please know that these energies could go back and forth, right? Like they can be completely irreversible, right? You could be saying, I'm the one doing that, right? I'm so wonderful, power and light, that's me. <laughs> Maybe it's your person, right? I'm just saying, uh, you know, the, the, yeah. could be vice versa all day long and twice on Sunday. So let's see what we have for 10 of Swords, Hero Fit, Justice, <laughs> 8 of Cups, and the King of Wands. I'm just taking them the way they want to come out here. Yeah, wow. The Ace of Swords is in your person's energy here. Mm -hmm. This looks like an ending big time. Maybe you're leaving somebody you're married to. It's 10 of Swords, the Hero Fit, and the Justice card. So let's see. Let's look at their current energy. Wow, Sagittarius. Wheel of Fortune, it's probably you, in their energy. The block for them is the Six of Wands. What they desire is the Page of Wands. And you want them to walk away, and they want to walk away from something. The block for your person is the Six of Wands. This may be overcoming maybe their own marriage with justice above. It could be... Uh, Maybe they just, you know, could just be victory showing up. Because it looks like they want to leave somebody here, and you want them to leave too. Unless your person wants to leave you, Sagittarius, but... Right? Possibility, but... I'm not really feeling that in this reading yet. So let's see what we have. And let's get some Oracle cards. Let's get one card from this deck. This is John Holland's deck. Mm-hmm. John Holland, the psychic, and... That what other I'm not sure what other uh, author. I'm not sure what other titles he uses or designation rather or yeah I'm not really sure. Professional titles all have to do with esoteric spiritual world. Let's see what we have for Sagittarius and their person. Let's go ahead and get a card. Show me the energy for Sagittarius and their person. And we have the obstacles and challenges this is the five of wands so this car this reading is about challenges right because we're going to take that as the kind of significator here like what's most significant right so let's look at and let's get some oracle cards too yeah let's do this and uh, let's see what we have and Let's use the little goss. I feel like I hard, don't really use these with, especially with Sagittarius readings. I feel like I don't for some reason. So let's see what we have. The little, excuse me, the little vampires. Little vampiritas. I'm not really sure if they call them that in Spanish, but maybe they do. Let's see what we have. I feel like it's, uh, I feel like that's one of the words that could be kind of like Spanglish where it just gets translated. You know, where it's almost the same word. Let's see, because it's uh, based on the Latin root. Show me the energy for Sagittarius and their person, or Sagittarius and their vampire. Okay, Sagittarius. Hope you don't have a blood sucker. Let's see, what we got <laughs> or an energy sucker here. Catalyst, creator, maker, mother, and father. Somebody looks like they have a family here. That could be the challenge, right? That could be the what is so challenging here, or obstacles, and we have allure, desire, and manipulation. It looks like here that you are, like, the person you want here could be married, because right in the block is justice, next to the hierophant. This is a marriage. Yeah, there. I feel like there's a marriage blocking you. Mm -hmm. So let's see what we have. <coughs> Let's look at your past energy here. This is the recent past. This could be your current energy with the ten, with the ten of swords. And now we have the nine of pentacles. <laughs> Page of pentacles. You look like you're ending something, becoming single, or it's going to depend. I feel like this is incomplete. I feel like there is a marriage here and there's somebody single, like third party, right? Why is this Page of pentacles there for 
Sagittarius, Ace of Cups, Hermit, <laughs> Three of Wands. I don't know, you could have let somebody go here. This is kind of... Why is it here if it's there for Sagittarius? This is your current energy. Six of Swords. You look like you're leaving a marriage. Devil card. Or you have... You could be, like, not so worried here. Possibly. <coughs> Excuse me, you guys. <coughs> With the devil in the reverse, maybe there's a Capricorn here, right? But I feel like you are, like, kind of... <coughs> Excuse me. Beg your pardon, guys. You could be like uh, kind of releasing yourself from all the fear and the bondage about somebody leaving their marriage. Yeah, if we kind of look a little deeper here. I feel because when we see justice in the block next to the Hierophant, somebody else's marriage looks like it's they're blocking you. Uh, or it's blocking you. Maybe your person is Virgo right here. Hermit. Libra's here. Aries is over here. And then, of course, uh, Taurus is here with the Hierophant. <clears throat> Why is the devil there? Why is the devil there for Sagittarius? Seven of Cups reversed. I mean, this could be saying you're no, you, you're no longer confused here, but at the same time, you're releasing yourself from some... Uh, from some like fear or bondage about this I feel like you want somebody to leave their union or you're leaving it right here you're leaving your own and you could have had you could have also been like in bondage or like all this fear here because maybe you wanted somebody to make a really hard choice to walk away from a marriage because the creator card is here too and it says maker mother and father and over here is seduction, allure, and desire, mm -hmm. and manipulation. So, you know, you could have let somebody go in the past that you really wanted a new beginning with. I feel like you did. Why is this three of wands there? I feel like you let them go because maybe they were married. Yes. Yeah, because that's what's blocking you. Death card. Yeah, you ended it with somebody. Looks like. This could be saying they ended it with their person. Possibility here. Strength card in the root with justice and the two of wands. You're trying to have courage about the situation. Maybe you have plenty of courage. This obstacles and challenges, somebody feels challenged. So Eight of cups is what you desire, Sagittarius, with the sun card. And the empress... So this is what you're desiring here. You want somebody to walk away. I feel like you want the clarity if they're walking away. I feel like you're the empress, the third party empress in this reading. Why is that three of, three of, why is the empress there? Sorry. It is a number three. Nine of wands. I feel like you want somebody to give up. I feel like you want the clarity here. You could be maybe wanting your happiness, right? With, you know, the sun card over here and the desire, like, right? Desire position, but I don't really feel like, I feel like you want clarity if they're giving up their situation. Yeah, you're like, you could have been waiting a long time. Maybe you ended it with them. Moon card over here. Okay, I feel like what it is. You have doubts that they're ever going to leave their person and ever make this really hard decision. I feel like that's what this reading is. The same person that you're really in love with, Ace of Cups, big time. They want to walk away too. I feel like it's from their situation. I feel like you ended it with them. You could have been just soul searching whether or not they were going to do this themselves. Because over here in your block is justice. Hierophants right here. Right? This is a marriage blocking you. And you're trying to have courage about it. You want to move forward. Two of wands with them. I feel like also you want them to choose you. That's why it's in the block. Two of wands. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> and in your fear, uh, Sagittarius, in your fear, never fear, Sagittarius, because uh, 2021 is coming around the corner, all right? Uh, I, I know it's going to be challenging. Somebody put over there on the comments that I was negative. No, I just know a lot. <laughs> And but I feel like it is at least going to be better than 2020, okay? So don't worry about stuff, Sagittarius, all right? Or anybody else for that matter. Mm -hmm. I feel like you've been worried about this person a long time or waiting for them. And while you were waiting, you were confused. Are they ever going to make up their mind and kind of be with me? Yeah, and there is a lot of allure here and desire. And in your fears or doubts, yeah, you're doubting they're ever really going to make this decision judgment. Yes, you're doubting they're going to make that decision to walk away and be with you. That's it. All right. So now let's look at the Ace of Swords. This is your person's past energy, uh, Sagittarius. Ace of Swords, Three of Pentacles, Five of Swords. <clears throat> I feel like your person over here had a mental, like, this could be saying they felt defeated. It could be saying they already defeated their person, their situation to have victory with you. They were, Or they were in defeat about it. We need more cards. Why is this five of swords? I feel like they could have had a mental breakthrough here. That maybe sabotage is necessary, right? Like, because it looks like your person, for some reason... You're you're you are wondering if they were gonna ever gonna come forward and maybe they know sabotage is like on the menu, like they have to do this in order to have you nine of cups right next to the wheel of fortune. You are their wish, Sagittarius. Yeah, their big wish in life, all right? Mm-hmm. Kinda like when somebody's like five years old. You want Santa to bring you something uh you've been wishing for a long time. Yeah, that's it, okay. <laughs> Yeah, you want this person. You're like, Santa, please, okay. <laughs> Santa Claus, please, <laughs> bring me bring me my person on a platter. Look at that, Nine of Cups. The man's like, okay, let's look at their current energy right now. This may be incomplete. Like, this could be a little bit short. Like, why is this Wheel of Fortune there? Like, maybe we need some more cards. Nine of Swords, Two of Swords. Your person is feeling stuck here about cutting that person out. I feel like they're maybe they think you're going to cut them out. <coughs> maybe they just don't know <coughs> know what to do here. Excuse me, guys. <coughs> Let's look at the block for them. 6 of wands, 4 of cups. They have to reject their person here in order to have victory. Two of Cups. Yeah, see, they're really in love with you, too. Here you are with the Ace of Cups, Sagittarius, about them. And here they are with the Two of Cups about you. These are two people who, like, don't want to live without each other. That's what it is. Page of Wands is their desires with the Magician reversed. <clears throat> The magician reversed is is like <clears throat> they could want a new begin. This is I feel like this is just they want a new beginning with you, but I feel like it's in the reverse because they know here that they have to, in order to manifest with you with this with you, they have to walk away. I mean, this is super clear. Why is this magician card reversed? Six of Pentacles. They're hoping that they're, to get their fair share. Maybe they have money to be divided with this other person. They're hoping you're going to work on... I know what they're hoping for. They're hoping if they walk away here from their person, are you going to work with them? Is there going to be harmony? Are you guys going to have an equal union, give and take, right? The kind everybody really kind of needs. Why is a magician and the six of pentacles there? Seven of pentacles. So now they want to wait, walk away twice. I feel like what it is, they want to walk away from their person, but they're fearing here, you know, not fearing, but they're hoping that you're going to work with them. Yeah, that's why this uh, two cards here about moving, uh, about walking away from somebody. And they could be hoping, yes, they're going to walk with their fair share, six of pentacles, seven of pentacles, 
<clears throat> this seven of pentacles, a man's walking away with only one pentacle. Your person's hoping they're going to get their fair share here when they walk away from that person. And in their fear is the emperor, the fear or their doubt, <clears throat> and the three of three of cups reversed, <clears throat> and the three of swords. <clears throat> they're fearing they're not going to reunite with you. I feel like they're doubting that this, they're, they can heal the situation with you. Wow. This Three of Swords is a healing Three of Swords. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel like they are. I feel like they're doubting they can kind of reunite with you and <clears throat> and heal the situation. We're going to find out all about them. Beg your pardon on my uh, voice today, you guys. And my Yeah, but... We're going to find out all about your person, Sagittarius, and see how they really feel about you, right? And what they feel like is blocking them, <clears throat> what they want most or what they're mostly concerned about. Uh, I feel like it's you, what they're hiding, what they're fearing, and their true intentions. They're all super affordable. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Thank you so much, guys.